Hello everyone. I keep finding little treasures and unfinished projects. So I thought I would just come along and do some work in my tab bound journal. Because I found all these pretty little tags. They were sitting in an envelope. Oh, thick piece of something rather there. Forgive me while I get rid of that. Dried glue. Hmm. Not good. I found this pocket and all these pretty little tags and bits of paper and, and stuff. So I thought, okay, well let's do something with it. So first up, I've put this little tag here. It says, a story is in you. Perfect for a journal, yes? Yes, thank you. Now I've already done those bits. I came across this part of a, a see-through envelope and I thought, okay, we can dress this up with a tag, a ticket, um, you know, whatever. So, out with the trusty board. Now, I'm just going to move those up there so I can see them. And I thought this would look lovely sitting down there in that corner. It fits perfectly, in my opinion. So, let's get some glue. I could actually leave that sticking out that way because it is... Do I have room? Oh, oodles of room because the other half of the butterfly is there. So if I put that out like a tab, turn it over and you say, yep, yeah, okay, that's, that's, that's my plan. Oh, I've got a little ring of glue, isn't that cute? It happens when I don't put the, the glue pot down onto the little section in the bottle, in the lid, sorry. There's a massive big glob of glue there. Let's spread it out a little bit. Put this over here so that I'm not reaching over in front of the camera. Good plan. Okay. Now I turn it over, move it up a little bit so you can see. There's the wing of the butterfly. I'm going to like that. Now there's this piece of glue, I can put that over the address. Do I want to tear it a little? Yes I do. Just a little, oh, something on that, oh, too late now. Too late, too late. That's got to go into a little pocket because it's already, hang on, let's, let's use the corner chomper on that. I'm having to use two hands is because this is an extra thick piece of paper backed with another piece of paper. Okie doke. Now that could sit in that pocket. Yes, of course it can. Now these have all got double sided tape on the back of them, so I'm blessed there because it's already done for me. Okay. Don't you hate it when you're used to using something and you forget and you go and use your, your fingernails and you think, no, nah, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Why am I doing this wrong? And I can... No, I can't. Can I? No, I can't. I thought I might be able to pop the top of the, the tag up above the page, but the, the glue goes all the way up into that section there, so I can't. Okay, so that's looking good. Now, what else can I put down here? Not that. I could put some cats down there, couldn't I? Cats, dogs, dogs. Yep. And this one I can rip, even though it's got the double-sided tape on it. I can still rip that. Now let's get some ink onto this. I should have done that to the ticket as well, put some ink on it. Sometimes I just don't stop and think, I just want to get done. Just 
do it, do it, do it, it's in my brain and, and I do it, do it, do it and then I think, ah, oh, but I could have done so and so. You know, he who hesitates is lost and knows there's quite a lot. <laughs> Okay, looking good so far. Now I think I might like some washi tape along this part. And I keep my washi tape, or some of my washi tape, on the, the table. This one is nice. It's got flowers on it, so let's use this one. And I want to go from top to bottom on this side just because it's so pretty. It's not in the same colour range, but you know what? I'm not fussed about that. I'm really not fussed. Okay, now to put something here so that I can put something into that pocket or into a pocket. Can I put the pocket there? Oh no, that doesn't look that doesn't look very tempting, does it? Oh, tempting. But if I've got something slender I can put in Behind that, and still have it as pocket. It would be a double pocket. I could have a pocket here and a pocket up there. That works for me too. Okay, so let's do this. Now, because we're doing a pocket, we need to put glue there. Because otherwise, the tape, whilst it is very good, doesn't always 100% go dry. There's always a little bit of moisture in the double-sided tape, which is why we like to use a bit of glue, because we know that that's going to dry dry. So good? Yes. I'm thinking so. Alright, now. What, 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 what can I put in behind here? That has to wait and dry. So in the meantime, let's do something down here. Quit your daydream, what do you reckon? Works for me. And I'm going to cut the top of that, the space with a little hole in. I don't really want that there. Just being a fuss budget for a change. Ah, ink! Yes, ink is a good thing. I remembered, I remembered. <laughs> so smart of me to remember, isn't it? Hey, look, somebody's got to sing my praises. Nobody else will. Okay, this little piece up here with the little matryoshka and the mushroom that could sit up there quite nicely. Ink. I nearly forgot.
You know what made me think it then? It was because I was going to take the tape off and I thought I can't hold it to put ink on with tape on it. Or with the, the, just the, yeah, without the backing. So, thank you, my twisted brain, for making me think like that for that instant. white space in here. I'm thinking some washi of a different colour. I've got some thin stuff, I think. Have I got anything? Not in this box, I don't have. But I've got this colour. Or I don't like that colour very much. It, it's no, it's too too yuck. And we've already got that florally one. So I'm thinking this one I can cut it into pieces, take the flowers off individually and line them up there. That's what I'll do. tape in ages. I think it's because I have a little case full of it, I've got enough. Put that one there. Excuse my arm. And the next flower is little roses. going to leave just a skerrick of room in between each one, I think, just to be different. And I have one more, and I don't know what this piece of flora is all about. It just looks like a little fern. something doesn't feel right, you've got to add something to it until you're happy. Can't draw, I've got a I've got a thing on my mouth. feel a lot happier. I like that. That's very good. Now I'm still trying to think what I'm going to put in the little pocket. I really don't know. Let's see how much colour I've got in this left in this little brush. Not a lot. That's okay, it means I can put it away. Okay, it needs to be just something skinny. A 
long tag would be perfect, a longish tag. Would be perfect. These are too short. So, what have I got that I can make a quick tag out of? Excuse me, reaching in front of you again. Oh, not that colour, it's a bit bright in your face. I'll just do one quickly in this dark brown so that I've got something in there to remind me that there is a space there and it needs to be filled. Now, two inches. A skerrick, just a smidge under two. And that top is as crooked as you can get. this away yet. I must have known I was going to use it. Beautiful. Close it down. the book. That was good of me. Ah, oh, terrific. Look at that. That's going to look lovely with something on the front of it. I just need something in there. Let's get out some flowers. It doesn't have to be very big. It doesn't have to be very wide. That might actually do it. Yep. I might make it two and seven eighths because that will give me a little black border to go around it, which will look pretty. Even that would look nice. But I think the other piece is going to look even better. Yeah. Okay, some double sided tape coming up my favourite go-to. I'd better do the short ends first. That way I will make sure that they are stuck down. finding these little treasure items that I've got stuck in big boxes and I come across them as I'm sorting so it's really quite lovely that I can use them straight away and the ones that I won't use straight away I'm now giving away so I'm 
involved in a Facebook page uh, titled Buy Nothing Junk Journals forward slash supplies. And they love it when people do happy mail or racks. And that's what I'm doing. I'm finding people that are just starting, want some inspiration, want to see how to do things. And I'm only too happy to supply that need. Because over the years I have amassed so much. You know, and um, I overcommit when I do things. Like I don't just do one or two tags. I do 20, 30 and just keep going. And it's now becoming really nice to share my bounty. Okay, that's it. Let's find some text for the top. That away. That away. Burnish this down first. And then I can put... No, I can't put that away yet. Because I need to burnish the text down. So, what have I got here? Show Grace is nice. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, Show Grace. That didn't take long. That one sort of jumped out at me and said, use me, use me. Here we go. This is one of those resources that, you know, you gather over the years and you keep them and keep them and keep them and all of a sudden you realise, I had those, I didn't remember I got those, but I better use them. Use them. Well, look at that. Isn't that pretty? I think it's lovely. And then we turn that over and we've got nothing down here. Okay. Have to do something about that. Can't have an undecorated face. Uh, let's do this one. Keep moving forward. And once again, I'm going to cut the top off. I still want it to be a ticket, so I can cut the top. Whoops. That's better. And then run it through the punch so that I get the top tag piece. Double-sided tape backing. That's pretty cool. Not. I know they're tags and I know they've got a hole in them, but I'm not going to put anything in the hole because I don't want this book to become a gator mouth. And believe me, I could very quickly do that. You add in some extra texture here and extra texture there and soon you, you've got a book that's this wide at the front and this wide at the, the spine. use the, the dogs again. Scissors. Put them away. And we need some colour on this. Off. And put 
there, right next to that one. Now I've got this up here that I just want to strengthen and for that we will use that brown washi because it almost brings in that lace. over here because we don't need them on the table. Fumble fingers are me. Right now I just need to turn this around a little bit so that I can work without feeling cack handed. Without feeling awkward. that little bit there. Not at all, because it brings out the colours here. That's good. That works for me. Okay, now to put our little friend back in here. And we are done. We are done. I really did enjoy that. Thank you for being with me. I hope you enjoyed watching as well. Those little things are going into my giveaway box. So there you go. A little bit of collage never goes astray. And finding lost treasures is absolutely wonderful. There's one, two, three, four tags that I've used on that one little piece of envelope. So it just shows, goes to show what you can do if you really think about it. So thank you for watching, thank you for coming back to see me, and I will catch you up on the next video. Bye bye for now, keep smiling, keep crafting.